You are looking at HP's new MediaVault MV2100 series. Now, if you're in the market for network attached storage, a little home server for your house, you might be very interested in this, and I'll tell you why. It's the price. This thing is cheap. Compared to some of the really expensive and really nice ones, it's very, very cheap. And even compared to the cheap, crappy ones, it's still very cheap. It's really cheap. And it does everything you want it to do. It has none of the extras. It's fantastic. Now, for those of you that don't know what an NAS is, or a NAS, or a NOS, as some people refer to it, not to be confused with NOS for your car, uh, an NAS is a networked attached storage device. So pretty much an external hard drive. And you couple that with a switch, and pretty much you put a hard drive on your network and then that can be accessed by multiple PCs within your home. You can also do a VPN, a virtual private network, so that other people can get on it or you can even get onto it via the internet. Now that's fantastic if you want to share your files or your music with your friends. Uh, you know, one buddy can go ahead and uh, give you some music and you can give him some music and it works out great. Uh, so it does all this stuff and it's really cool for that. Now this thing, um, is a 500 gigger. So let me tell you about this in particular one. Now this is a 500 gigger. It's got two bays. So you can add another 500 or you can add a 1TB in there or anything smaller or bigger. It's up to you. You can even remove the one that's in there and make it two terabytes total. Now if you have two in here you can do a RAID 1. RAID 1 if you don't know what it is is a copy. You get one hard drive doing it and then the other hard drive does an exact copy. So in case one dies you got the second one to back it up. It's called mirroring. It's for redundancy. If you're a photographer, if you're a video editor, you you need that redundancy. You spend all this time taking that picture, making that video, and editing it. That's your content. It might be part of your business, or even more importantly, sometimes part of your creative life. It might be social for you or important. You want to have that backed up. So if a drive fails, you get it all backed up. Now, what else does this thing do? You can use it as an iTunes server. So you can go ahead, put all your music on here, not have to have a big hard drive on your computer and just stream it right off of this through your network. And it does, it's gigabit network, so it's very fast, gigabit LAN. Uh, what else can you do with it? Remote web access, uh, you know, you can get onto it through a website, access any of the files, download them, stream them off the web, do whatever you want. You can share your photos off of this so you don't have to trust your photos to a website that you may or may not trust. I'll tell you what else you can do. You can back up all the computers at your house on this thing. It comes with uh, backup software and it's very easy to use. It's called the NTI Shadow. That's the, the company that made it. I used it and it was fantastic. It was really easy to set up. There was actually nothing to do. You don't have to worry about anything and it's all really simple on board. You plug it in, you run the disc and that's it. It's very simple. You can also uh, connect your Xbox 360 your PS3, any consoles that you have, anything that's DLNA compliant will work on this thing. So it's really cool, really fantastic. Uh, I'll show you real quick how you can see it inside. It's got one drive on the inside and then a, a caddy for the other one, well, which you can just pull out and add your one terabyte. There is a USB up here in the front, so that's really convenient if you want to just plug in storage off of someone's external hard drive and then put it into your drive. Uh, taking a look at the back here, I'll just show you the connectivity. It's not much to look at, but you do have a Kensington lock, USB, and then of course the gigabit ethernet with your power switch. So that's very, very nice. Obviously that's your power connection right there. So in the end, uh, at a price point where you're below 60 cents a gig, this thing is awesome. The price you're paying is almost what you're paying for internal storage, but it's got the, you know, it's a network attached storage and it works just like the more expensive ones. Uh, it doesn't have some of the more advanced features, but for most people who want to back up, store all your media on here, it's perfect. And of course it's expandable up uh, to, let's see what, two terabytes, so which is plenty. And you can either do it redundantly, so you have one terabyte backed up with the other terabyte, or you can do two terabytes total if you trust your hard drives. That's how I do it. I do server grade hard drives and then I back up off site. All right, so. In the end, it's a steal. It's uh, simple, it's sleek, it's easy to use. Uh, it's a great overall buy, especially at the price point. If you have any questions on it, you know where to email me. I'll see you guys next time. For more information on the HP MV2120 Media Vault, go to compusa.com and type in H25-2120 into the search box. Or you can call us 24 hours a day, seven days a week at 1-800-COMP-USA.